The stadium's location itself is one of its key features. So on one side of it, we've got Parramatta Park, an amazing green space that's accessible to all. On the other side, the city. So the way in which the stadium both integrates into the city from its proximity, but also integrates from a green space perspective into the Parramatta Park has been one of its most successful features. When people were walking past as the stadium was built, one of the, the most regular questions I was asked was, when is the skin going on the outside? Actually, the design pays homage to the industrial era that was Parramatta and its outer western Sydney suburbs of Sydney. So really celebrate the steel, uh, celebrate the roof structure, and actually I think it does give it that nice urban edge. Banquet Stadium is actually part of the UNESCO World Heritage listed site. So with that in our design actually came a range of features that we had to accommodate. So being able to see from Old Government House through to the cathedral was a really important part of the, of the building and it actually helped design the height part of it because really we've sunken it down into the slope of the land a little bit um, to allow the canopy of the trees actually sits away above and beyond uh, the height of the roof. One of the things that Venues New South Wales really appreciates is the importance of having the vibrancy that wraps around the stadium. So one of the things we've done is we asked the architects to develop a, an urban jungle, if you like, an urban parkland down O'Connell Street. The way in which that urban jungle reaches out and encourages people to be physically active, I think that's a really nice element of the stadium. When you build a facility as significant as a 30,000 seat stadium, there are a whole host of things that you have to do from a management plan perspective. One of the things we really had to think about was around um, how you would accommodate and, and support the natural fauna and flora. So we ended up planting 270 trees uh, across 15 different species across the site. That actually were consistent with the eucalypt uh, forest that runs along the riverbank. And actually, when you look at it, particularly from the other side of the river, it actually integrates beautifully. Lee Gold is a, uh, an internationally recognised uh, environmental uh, rating system that early on um, the government set us the task of reaching that goal. So that was both not just about the design but the way in which we harvested water, the way in which we thought about our sustainability concepts, the way in which it interacted with the environment. The park is home to a colony of 15,000 microbats and also grey-headed flying foxes. So from our perspective, their keen sensitivities are both around noise and light. We've designed the roof and the LED lights. They actually now inward, they sit underneath the roof canopy, avoiding a whole host of light spill into the park. So on the roof, there are solar panels that collect and harness the sun's energy. It's actually utilising the power of the sun and putting back into our facility for non-game day experiences. Underneath the Western Grandstand is where the industrial kitchens are, it's like a mini recycling city. The food scraps are separated from uh, plastic and, and then recycled. Um, it's quite an amazing space uh, and that is effectively like the heartbeat of the stadium where we try to, to recycle as much as we possibly can. Whether it's the ventilation and vacuum system that underpins the, uh, the drainage system for the stadium, whether it's the paint that recycles the water off the roof and then we use that whether it's for toilet flushing or irrigating the field of play and also all the gardens. I mean they are some of the really nice features that help us from a uh, operational aspect but actually keep that stadium looking look just a million dollars. I'm, I guess, proud as punch, really, in many ways. I think from us, a really nice uh, icing on the cake that both the stadium that works tremendously well functionally actually is now working really well from a sustainability perspective.